Un Academy. Let's crack it. There's a lot of corruption in police department. Pull IPS is your number two yes, choice. Hmm? And uh, the cases of uh, third degree torture are becoming very frequent. Even custodial deaths are also becoming very common these days. So supposing you get into IPS service, what uh, action will you take against such thing? So it is a sad, uh, it is a sad state of affair. Hmm. And uh, if given the opportunity, first tell me whether is a third degree torture a legal, legitimate process or it is illegal in our country? Sir, pardon me, I am exactly I, unaware okay, of okay. this. Whatever you know, you can just tell me. Sir, uh, sir, in present, I do not think that it is legally permitted, uh -huh. the third degree of torture. But uh, at times, to get these statements out of the witness, that is practiced and it is a sad state. And if given the opportunity, sir, I will try to enhance the accountability of the officers and the transparency in the investigation mechanisms. Sir, where uh, proper SOP designings could be there, its rationalization could be there. And sir, uh, installation of CCTV cameras is a practical step that could help to enhance the uh, police verification and investigation. So, I will be working upon those steps, sir. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, what has been your experience in Uttar Pradesh Civil Service? You are working as a deputy collector. Sir, right now I am an officer training and the officer training, training has just started uh, two weeks back. So it has been a pleasant experience. Mm -hmm. And uh, apart from the classroom programs that we had regarding the basics of the revenue as a revenue okay. officer, the departments will be working. We had been taken to field trips also. How can we encourage right persons in politics? Do you propose or do you think there should be an entrance exam? No, ma'am. According to me, uh, yes, the need of uh, improvement of the politics is there, but a kind of entrance exam for the politicians would not be solving the purpose because ma'am, politics is a different kind of uh, uh, work, and for the for the for them, ma'am, that as we say, Jan Pratinidhi. So for them. There is no criteria on the basis of education that we can derive for. If the person is able to <coughs> satisfy the demands of the people of the country, then uh, he can be said as a politician, as a person who can lead. What is patriarchal bargain? Ma'am, patriarchal bargain was a concept given by Dennis Kandiyoti, one of the socio prominent sociologists. Uh, it basically says that uh, in some extent women do uh, exchange their position in the society so as uh, and coincide with the view of the male so that they can improve their overall situation in the societal sphere. For example, uh, ma'am, the mother-in-laws in a family at times trade their positions so as to enhance their uh, image in respect to the uh, new bride that is coming. Uh, Arnav, uh, I'm sure you must have gone through the budget this time. Have you? Yes, ma'am. I had. What were three most important changes that you saw in the budget, which you think will give a boost to Indian economy? Ma'am, first is the focus upon fiscal consolidation. It was entirely visible throughout the budget. Second would be, ma'am, the capital expenditure, which had been in increased largely. And third, ma'am, there was an overall focus on inclusivity of each and every section of the society. How? Ma'am, the programs that have been brought in basically uh, touched each and every aspect and uh, each and every group of the society. For example, ma'am, there was a scheme started for the PVTGs that were earlier very much mar marginalized. Was there no scheme earlier for PVTGs? Ma'am, there were schemes, but now we have seen that increased focus upon them and more budgetary allocations are there. So the idea that is being propagated of Sabka Saath, Sabka Vikas, uh, is visible to some extent in the in the budget and itself. And what was something that disheartened you in the budget? Ma'am, it could not be said as disheartening, but uh, I believe that a further focus on uh, capital expenditure, keeping in mind the fiscal consolidation idea, if done, 
then ma'am it would be helpful in uh, utilizing the demographic dividend of the country All and right. providing the youth with opportunities